Hello, and welcome to Pristis. I'm the founder, Renee Cody, and today we're going to be talking about the Ubi Diaper Pail. I'm going to review it and show you my first impressions as I have never seen it before, but I got these in from my shop because they are oh so popular, so let's get to it. But first, if you don't mind liking this video, it helps me out more than you know, and also all of the products I'm about to show you are available on my shop, pristis.com. Now on with the show. So my first impression, the boxes come like this, very standard, nothing to be super impressed with, but at the same time, do you really want your packaging to look super <laughs> impressive on your doorstep? Let's go ahead and open this thing up. Make sure you point your knife away from you and not towards you like you just watched me do. This particular Ubi that we are opening is in the color Chrome. And the first thing we see when we open it up is a smiley face on the inner packaging, which is super cute. Now we'll go ahead and open up the white one as well. That Ubi smile is pretty much their trademark. You can see it right in their logo, the little smiling face. It's hard to see something with that smiley face on a baby product and not know that it is Ubi. Now I have tried several other Ubi products. I have not looked at their diaper pails. Full disclaimer that I actually have a diaper genie. I bought one, I had three kids and I just had another baby. So that's my fourth kid. And we had used Diaper Genie previously. I hadn't even heard of Ubi until you guys told me. And this one that we're opening up is a slate color. But the Ubi products that I used previously are some bath products. I used their bath mat and the little foam scrubby thingy it's made of rubber silicone sorry silicone bath sponges they're so helpful for my baby this is my fourth baby and this baby is the first that i've had that have had hair upon birth and that rubber sponge has helped so much in washing her hair and this one is the gray wood grain ubi which i was kind of curious about but okay, so we see they all have the smiley. All right, let's get all the boxes in order so that we can open these all up and see what they all look like with the different colors. One Ubi product that saved my patootie on bath day, my baby had just grown too big for like a, a bathroom sink, but was still too small and rubbery and floppy for a regular bathtub. So we washed her in a, like a washroom sink, which was bigger than the bathroom sink, but smaller than a bathtub. And we didn't have a, like a plug for the sink. And Ubi created a universal one. It's on my website, pristis.com. And that totally saved me. I love it so much, but it's not like metal or anything. It's just solid. So there's nothing that the baby would sit on inside the tub that would make the baby uncomfortable. All right, let's take these things out so we can actually see the inner packaging inside each one. Now I tried to just take it out from the top. It did not work. This way worked much better, just kind of sliding it out slowly. I didn't realize that all of these were steel. That seems to be Ubi's, one of their claim to fame is that it is a steel diaper pail instead of just plastic, like the Diaper Genie very very solid it's also safe i didn't realize that it has a safety locking feature until later you'll see in the video this one here is the that i just unboxed is the chrome one the one to the left is the wood grain gray wood grain version so we have the gray wood grain and the chrome the chrome looks so pretty do you guys have a favorite color yet and then actually this one is one of my favorites that we're unboxing right now slate the slate color i think that is so on trend right now it's just absolutely beautiful and then the final color of course classic white all right so we have all four colors here so my first impression is that surprise actually i didn't realize that you don't need special bags and it's made of steel. I didn't realize there was a child safety lock either. I really hadn't looked into these before I ordered them. I just ordered them because they were so popular for the shop. And really, I wasn't really sure what kind of bags you used because the diaper genie, you put one big bag in there and then tie it at the bottom. So I wasn't sure exactly how this worked. So let's do the unveiling inside the box. Ta-da! First impression, thank goodness it's all in one piece and super easy to open. It's just perfect inside the box, ready to take out. Yay! All right, so let's take this thing out. 
This is the wood grain one. Super shiny. I wasn't expecting it to be so shiny, so simple. All right, let's unbox the rest of these here. This one is the chrome version. And you can see the chrome top. I love the white right on top like that, uh, accented with the chrome. It makes it look really modern and cool. Like this is not your mom's diaper genie type thing. And then we have the slate version here. Also super easy to open. Also really cool with the white accents around the dark slate gray. They nailed that slate gray color. It's almost like a bluish slate hint. And like just a hint of blue, not a lot, just that French gray blue type color. Okay, and then we have the white over here, which you'll see it <laughs> took me a minute to get that one out. But all in all, opening the packages, getting it unboxed and ready to go, super easy, much easier than some of the other unboxing videos that we've done together on this channel. Ubi's really thought of it all and I love that they had it all put together. I didn't have to do anything. All right, so up close and personal, these all look so pretty, but I wasn't really sure how to work it. So my first impression was like, okay, it opens here. Obviously that's where the diapers go. Here's the thingy. I don't know exactly what this is for. Obviously it's for the diaper to go inside. Might be for a bag. I'm not sure because Ubi said no bags, but it's to get things in there. And I wasn't really sure how to open this. I was like, why isn't it opening? And then I realized, oh, okay. I wasn't sure if it popped up or what. And then I realized, oh, there's a lock. Oh, that's what it is. So there was this child lock. And when it's locked, you can't open it. When it's unlocked, you can, which is great if you have children close together in age. So the whole thing, really, really easy to use and you don't have to use special bags, I guess. Ubi does have bags. So they have kind of like, if you think of like doggy bags to pick up doggy poop, it's kind of like that. And I have those also in my shop and they have one called triple odor protection or something. And, and so you can put your baby's diaper in that, tie it and then put it in the Ubi. Overall, these are really upscale feeling and looking. They look so cool and feel so cool for any modern day nursery. It's so much more upscale than the Diaper Genie for sure. However, I am a little bit nervous because I've used a Diaper Genie so long. So switching to something like this feels like it would be extra work. It seems like you don't need like any type of brand name garbage bag to go in it. So you use it more like a diaper garbage can where you can put in any like kitchen type of garbage bag, just those white standard size kitchen bags. And then once you put it in, then you can either just throw the diapers in or you can use the Ubi special bags and throw them in if you're especially worried about smells. Because I don't know about you, but if you've ever had kids, there's some diapers that can get through any diaper genie or Ubi or anything ever. Just, woo, just take that one outside. Overall, I really like it. And I'm probably going to switch out my diaper genie with one of theirs because it is so cool looking and just, it's so nice to be able to buy just a regular kitchen garbage bag instead of continually buying the really expensive diaper genie bags. I also really like the child safety thing on top because once my baby gets a little bit older, she might step on the diaper genie thing and get her little fingers stuck in it. So that's a definite concern there. My biggest problem though is deciding if I want the chrome one or the slate one. So tell me which color is your favorite down below in the comments. Don't forget to give this video a like. Remember each like helps me more than you know. And also a reminder, all of these are available on my website, pristis.com. And I'll see you guys next week.